What's up, ballers? We are back with some more NBA Live Mobile, so I've got a lot of caching up to do. Ended up having really bad timing with when the program came out and when I had to travel. So two straight days, I wasn't going to have any Wi-Fi, wasn't able to record, but I was able to actually play the game. So I've been stacking up packs for variety pack opening. Not my biggest one, but it's all the ones that I've been able to buy from the store, as well as a few others. So we got one that could potentially contain 99. Connie Hawkins, I believe is his name. I had actually never heard of him before, but I believe he played in the ABA uh, back in the day when it was ABA and NBA. Also got a 91 plus player and some elite players as well. So we're gonna go ahead and get started and see if we can get anything good out of here. Working towards a couple of different 99 cards. Not gonna open those top ones because we don't really have any need for them. Summer Quartz bonus pack. I'm not sure if that has anything but collectibles. Nope, just collectibles. So nothing special in those. We'll go ahead and get those out of the way. And working towards 99 Iverson, 97 Bernard King, and here we go, Summer Quartz Pro Pack. Hopefully this has something good in it. I opened a couple of these and didn't really get much special out of them. Yeah, so they don't even have a guaranteed Summer Quartz player, which doesn't really make a lot of sense to me. And they also removed Pro Packs from the store. <laughs> we opened two of them. I'm not going to open any more of those because they seem like a pretty big waste of coins. Here we go with the Summer Quartz Packs. We have more guaranteed stuff in here. Hopefully we can get some good stuff besides collectibles. Hey, there we go. We get a gold summer course player. All right, so we get a couple of them. And we can do an update team right there for my summer courts team because it's pretty low right now. For the most part, I only have those base cards and then a couple random ones that I picked up along the way. These summer courts packs are actually coming from mostly from sets, I believe. Uh, so we get an 83 Greg Monroe there, 77 Julius Randle, and lots of collectibles. If you guys are in need of some coins for this new program, definitely make sure you check out my sponsor, MMOGO. They've got some cheap, reliable NBA Live mobile coins, and if you use the code BOBBY, you can get a discount. So make sure to check out their link down in the description. We are not getting a whole lot out of these packs so far. Hopefully we can start to heat up a little bit. We'd like to see some elites out of here. We get a Brandon Ingram. He's been balling out for the Lakers and a throwback Kyle Korver. Lonzo Ball getting some, uh, being a little up and down in his summer league debut. So started out, first game was, I believe, two for 15 for five points, along with three turnovers. Had a couple assists and rebounds, but really nothing all that impressive. Here we go. We get a Summer Quartz Legend Pack, 150K pack, I believe, and has the potential to pull. Oh, Connie Hawkins. Ooh, there we go. We get an 86 Jalil Okafor. That's a nice pull. And we still got a shot at that 99. Seems unlikely. Ooh, a Larry Bird collectible. All right, that was actually a pretty nice pack. I will take that. We probably close to made our coins back. I know the price of elites has definitely dropped a lot, but hopefully it's going back up. Anyways, here we go. Our first guaranteed elite player, and we get an 87 Gerald Green. Not much special there since we already have Bernard King at our small forward position. Next elite player, give me something good. And Ben Simmons. All right, really the only thing that would really help us is the... Uh, as if it was a 91 or above, which seems unlikely. We'll go ahead and open these gold players real quick. And if we have enough, we'll probably end up tossing some of these guys into sets. So we should have some, some more elite player packs toward the end. Just getting lots of golds. I'm not even sure if it's possible to pull an elite out of these. I know sometimes they have packs that just say gold and it's actually possible to pull an elite, but... Probably not the case for these. Anyways, Lonzo Ball also getting a triple-double in his most recent game. So like I said, a little bit up and down. Summertime collectibles, nothing special in here. But we'll probably have enough to open a couple of sets after this. So we got one more regular Elite Summer Quartz player. And we get another Ben Simmons. And then a 91 plus. I believe the best option is a 97 Lance Stevenson. I guess we'll see. I'm hoping we get some more players because it would be nice to have some more variety in these packs. Three, two, one. Hey, there we go. 93 Devin Booker. That's a nice one, actually. That's going to be really, really good for our shooting guard spot. 91 three-pointer. That being said, I am about to pick up Allen Iverson, who's a 99 and also a shooting guard. 
So he's actually going to be there, probably taking his place. Although I actually don't think that you can have two of those players. Uh, I don't think you can have him in your summer lineup and your shooting lineup. So I might actually end up keeping this Devin Booker. He's got nice stats, 91 three-pointer, 86 speed, 87 dribbling, 86 shooting. So we'll hit update team, and then we will go ahead and complete the rest of those sets that we can. Let's see what we've got. How close are we to Connie Hawkins? And uh, I don't have any players I can throw in there. I'm not sure why it has an exclamation mark next to it. So we've got gold collectibles. Oh my goodness, lots of gold. So that should enable us to open more of the elite player packs as well. Let's see if we got something good. Let's see. And why am, why am I trying to hype it up? It's pretty much a guaranteed gold. <laughs> um, but yeah, it's been fun to watch these summer league games. Just kind of see how the players are performing. I have high hopes for uh, Dwayne Bacon. I believe it's Dwayne Bacon playing for the Hornets. Dropped 28 and 9 the other night, I believe, which is pretty impressive. Now, that being said, it is Summer League, so that's kind of what I say about Lonzo getting a triple double as well. Just watching some of his baskets, people just pretty much opened up the lane and he drove in and dunked. So, not a lot of impressive stats uh, along that line, but there have been some solid games, so a lot to look forward to in the NBA this season. I am really excited. Probably the most I've ever kept up with the NBA. Here we go. All right, so we got another update team right there. We pull an 88 Dwight Howard. I think that was actually one of our better options. Oh, my gosh. Look at those stats. Oh, 38 passing, 34 three-pointer, 36 dribbling. I don't think I've ever seen that many 30 overall stats on a card before. Toss in a couple more of these. And then we're going to be doing a shopping spree soon to get that Allen Iverson and Connie Hawkins. So make sure, ooh, Gary Harris, Michigan State alumni, make sure to hit that subscribe button and the like button if you guys want to see that. I know I've got at least 18 mil that I can toss in there, so, oh, yeah, mm, do I want to do it? You know what? Oh, don't have enough anyway, so I guess we're not going to do it. I was thinking it was only five players. So we're probably going to call it quits on that one. We are getting close to this Allen Iverson as well. So, like I said, going to be doing a shopping spree for those two. Make sure to drop a like down below if you guys enjoyed and want to see that. And I will see you guys next time.